हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई एम जहांगीर जाड़ी एंड इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट ओवर थिंकिंग ओवर थिंकिंग इज अ वेरी कॉमन प्रॉब्लम इन पीपल एंड अलाउट ऑफ पीपल फेस मेनी डिफिकल्टीज इन कंट्रोलिंग इट सो इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट वॉट ओवर थिंकिंग इज एंड हाउ इट कैन अफेक्ट आवर लाइफ इन बोथ पॉजिटिव एंड नेगेटिव वेज सो लेट गेट स्टार्टेड so what happened now i was about to start but i quit before starting why did this happen what made me do it my thoughts yes my thoughts made me do it i was anticipating too much about the result that i lose my confidence i lose my faith and that resulted in failure i quit before even trying because i was thinking too much about the result that my whole focus got shifted toward the end result instead of my current work so what would have happened if i was not thinking too much what if i was only focused on my work what if i was motivating myself instead of doubting myself what if i was motivating myself instead of doubting my abilities only one way to find out let's do this again so did you notice one thing in both videos what was the difference between these videos in first video my whole focus was on the end result i was worrying too much about the result that my focus got shifted toward the result instead of my work whereas in the second case i was motivating myself in doing something i was only focused on my work instead of the end result and that worked for me that will work for you also because if you only worry about the result or the failure you won't even try and you and if you won't even try how will you know that it was a failure or was a success instead of only worrying about the result or failure you should attempt you should try to do it just forget about the success or failure just give your best at that moment but you know one thing overthinking can be good in many ways like many scientists have done some great discoveries and inventions with it for example if we talk about newton we all know the story behind the apple that how an apple fall on him and he discovered gravity and all that but what if this was not the case what if he was thinking about something else at that time what if he started having thoughts like why this apple fall on me only am i the unfortunate guy here but he didn't think all these things instead he became curious that why did it fall on the ground only why didn't it float after that he start doing his research that there is a force that attracts things towards down and all these things and that's how he discovered about gravity imagine what if he didn't discovered gravity at that time if he was having some other thoughts instead of being curious how would the world would be now just imagine we would have no aeroplanes we wouldn't have gone to moon and all these things would have happened if the gravity was not discovered by him i know it is hard to control our thoughts but it is not impossible by following some techniques you can overcome it like whenever you are having thoughts about something too much you could meditate you could motivate yourself you should uh, go ask for some help you should talk to someone you should shift your focus from that thing and the best thing is to and the best thing to do is to let it go let go all your thoughts just focus on the work and not the results only these things will help you eventually as you progress you will get better over it and it will 
be good in the end. So that is all for today. I hope this video will be helpful for you. If you like this video, please give a like and do subscribe to my channel so that you can enjoy my videos in the future and also turn on the notification so that you will get a notification. So that's all for today. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, keep growing and keep shining. So that is all for today. I hope this video will help you. If you like this video, do subscribe to my channel because this motivates me to create more and more content for you. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, keep growing, keep shining and keep learning. Best of luck.